Hey guys! So today we're here to do a double header. Uh, two bands that reached out and got in touch with us. I know it's not Monday. Yeah. We normally do these on Monday. But we've really had a, such a large influx lately of bands asking us to check out their music that this week we decided to throw them a bone. Yeah. You know, let's check these bands out. Uh, because if we just wait every single Monday to do this, eventually, like, we can't get to everybody. And I really yeah. feel bad. Because, you know, the bands put a lot of work into their music, a lot of work into their videos, and then they contact us, ask us to check them out, give them a review, and really help. It takes help. like a year for us to get to them. I know, some of them has been like months. So, today we're here to check out a brand new video. This just came out last week. Uh, the name of the band is Foredoomed, and the name of the song is Dualism. By the way, both bands today are from Finland. Yeah. I believe both bands are from the same label as well. So, kind of cool, cool connection. Yeah. So, these guys got in touch. It was funny because I was already planning on checking out this video anyways. So they sent us a message saying, hey, by the way, guys, we have a new video. Could... And it was like, yeah, I know. You have a new video. We were going to check it out. So, like, you know, it's kind of funny. Um, I really don't know what the genre is, what the style. I, I don't know anything about this band. I don't know anything about this song or the video. Uh, normally, I, I Google and yeah. I check at least what the genre is, what the style. I, I'm, not, I'm not even bothered. Yeah. I figure let's just... Usually you're the one that picks these, so I just sit down and I'm like, oh, so what country What country today, Father? Yeah, but I, I, I honestly, I didn't even took the time to find out more about him. I just wanted to be... Surprised. Surprised. Let's yeah. see what, what happens. You ready? Okay.
right. Ooh. So, what do you have to say about that? I'm gonna let you go first. I have a couple of things to say, but I'm gonna let you go first. I love his. I love the whole starting part where he's like nice vocals, and then nice clean vocals, and it kicks you, and then he goes with his harsh vocals. And I like the I like how he changes from his harsh vocals to his clean vocals. And then there was a point where his clean vocals kind of sounded like they were in, like um, like a machine, like a kind of like, like weird way. But it sounded really cool. Yes. Now, did you notice the keyboard in the background? Yeah. I really like the keyboard melody in the background, especially when he was using the clean vocals. That's when you could hear really yeah. the keyboard melody. I thought the two things really added a lot of combined they add a lot of melody to the song but let me say this and tell me what do you think about this maybe i'm completely wrong when the video started i was like shit man tommy from sabaton lost a lot of weight and i didn't know he was playing in a finnish metal band like when did this happen didn't you don't you see the resemblance kind between of, the yeah between the lead singer of this band and tommy from sabaton oh my god a lot of even in the clean vocals there was a lot of resemblance i mean tommy can hit a little bit of a higher note but uh, I was like, wow, Tommy from Sabaton? He's from Finland? <laughs> Anyways, that was my first take when I saw the video starting. That, that's the first thing came to my mind. I was kind of shocked with the harsh vocals because when he start, the song starts so mellowed out yeah. with clean vocals. I wasn't expecting at any point in time for harsh vocals to come in. I thought, I thought it was, was going to be like a nice... Yeah, I thought it was going to be like a, like almost like a, a nice mellowed out like just song. So the harsh vocals kind of threw me for a loop there. I wasn't expecting But the, the changing between harsh vocals and clean vocals... Uh, yeah, because the right time because the clean vocals were were in the chorus and then the yeah. harsh vocals is throughout the song and then when you add that keyboard melody in the background oh. that keyboard melody was absolutely incredible the, uh, very similar to melodies that you hear from uh, children of Bodom and their in their keyboard and how they use the keyboard very similar the the sound was very similar um, uh, another thing I noticed was that the solo I really dig the, yeah. the the guitar solo the guitar solo was absolutely badass. Uh, really cool song. Yeah. Wow. Like I, I like the dynamic of the song. Like you said, I, I, there's so many things about that song that I enjoyed. The harsh vocals. I wasn't expecting the harsh vocals. I mean, I don't. I didn't even know what to. Because you have to look at it this way. We didn't know what to expect coming in, yeah. right? So I thought, okay, maybe it's going to be just like a ballad or something. Like yeah. the whole song is going to go like that. So those, those harsh vocals threw me for a loop. Another thing I noticed is the use of of, of a rose in the video. Like the people had the rose and then yeah. they had the knife behind their back and then. They went to stab each other. The video cuts off that part, and you see the rose on the floor. I, I don't, don't understand what the connection is between Finnish metal bands and roses to sim to signify life and death, because Blood Red Hourglass uses them in their last two videos as well, yeah. where the roses signified life and death. I, I don't know if there's a um, the thing with a cultural connection yeah. with roses and and, sim and the symbolism behind them. I don't know, but it's kind of strange that both bands kind of used that specific flower as, as a symbol to life and death. I thought that was kind of cool. Cool and interesting at yeah. the same time. All right, guys, stay tuned. There's another video coming right after from another band from Finland that got in touch with us. And uh, I honestly don't know what to expect from them either. Me neither. So let's see what happens. See you guys. See ya.